Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's Patricia and it is yet another Scentsy video. So as Scentsy consultants, we are able to buy transition kits or just different kinds of kits in general. This is a transition kit, so it gives you little samples of all of the new fragrances for whatever season it is, along with some of the recurring favorites for that same season. So I'm gonna get started with the brand new fragrances. But I wanted to give an update first on the Scentsy Flower. So as you can see, almost half of the oil has been absorbed into the flower. And you can see that the flower has bloomed bigger than it was. I will post a video above so you can check out my video on the flower. But I made a mistake. I forgot to tell you guys that on this flower at the bottom, there's tape on that and you have to take the tape off of the cord so the cord kind of spreads out and the oil diffuses now the oil did already go up through this anyway but i did want to say that another scentsy consultant saw my video and sent me an email and i just want to thank you for that i appreciate it so I wanted to let you guys know, once you get this flower, make sure you take the tape off of the bottom so that your oil diffuses properly. Okay, so now for the good stuff. I'm going to go over the eight holiday fragrances. So let's get started. I'm going to start with Eskimo Kiss. And you saw I had this one already. I went ahead, jumped the gun, and purchased it. Now, I should have bought the kit first to go over with you guys and then buy the bars, but I went off of what I knew I was going to like with the bars, so I just went ahead, bought six full bars of the new fragrances. I've already shared them on the channel. Um, just go back and take a look at it. I'll probably put it at the end of this video so you can check that out. But the notes for Eskimo Kiss are blackberry jam, caramelized brown sugar, vanilla, and amber. So if you've been watching my channel for any amount of time, perfume videos, wax videos, you know that I love this fragrance. So I do not have this, I have not worn this in wax form yet, but I do have this in my Scentsy pod and I used it in the brand new diffuser fan the little one that I showed you previously. It works great, it throws well. I have it in my dining room and I can smell it throughout the whole dining room and also in the hallway right as you walk into the dining room, I can smell this. Next we have Be Merry and it is described as joy abounds in pine bows dotted with holly leaf and cassis. I think I have this one also. I do. It's a great berry pine fragrance. I did a review on this already because it was one of the ones that I purchased outright. It's a nice mix. It's not too piney. It's not gonna like blow you out the house, but it's a good one. Next we have Pure Peppermint. Cooler than most, Pure Peppermint is the popular kid you'll love to love. So let's check it out. It's peppermint. It smells like a piece of peppermint candy with the red stripes on it that you put in your mouth every Sunday when you go to church. Next one is Christmas Cottage. This is a cozy inviting blend of Valencia oranges, raspberries, cloves, and spices. I have the brand new catalog, so that's why you see me looking to the side because I'm reading everything from the catalog for you. So, okay, this is your Christmas. Ooh, this, this kind of took me back to childhood. There was something my parents had that smelled just like this. You can smell the oranges, the cloves, the spices. God, I'm wondering what that was. Oh my God. This really, this took me back some decades. That is really gonna bug me what this was, but I, I like this because it just took me back. 
And that's what a great fragrance is supposed to do, is evoke memories, hopefully wonderful memories. Wow. Next we have Very Merry Cranberry. It says lush red winter berries pop against a backdrop of snow-covered cedar, creating a lovely winter landscape. I think I have this one also in the wax bar. Hmm. Okay. I smell cranberry. And I smell a little cedar. I do have this one because I remember saying that in the previous video. This is nice. I haven't warmed any of these yet because I'm still trying to get through other bars before I... I'm trying to save these for the holidays. We have very snowy spruce. Breathe in fresh forest air. Balsam, spruce, and cedar branches embrace the warmth of amber and woody pine cones. Let's see. Wow, this takes me back also. This smells like Christmas. You can smell the pine cones. Mmm. This is nice. This is really, really nice. This is your traditional sitting around the tree, your fire's burning, you're drinking your cocoa. This is Christmas in a wax bar. Wow. I like this a lot. Next we have Silver Bells. Mint candy canes and winter pear enveloped in a blanket of caramel and vanilla sugar. I have this one as well already. I have not warmed, as I just said, any of these yet. And this is a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. Mmm. I love this a lot. You can definitely, you can smell the candy canes, but it's nothing like the peppermint one that we just smelled earlier. The vanilla. I love the vanilla. I don't really smell the caramel yet, but it's like a mix of what I'm getting right off the top of my head is the mint and the vanilla. Beautiful. And the last one we have is Homestead Holiday. This is blood orange cinnamon freshened by fur needle. I'm a little afraid of this one. It, it's a beautiful blue wax though. Okay. I smell the cinnamon. I smell the orange and I, I do smell the fur needle. So you can smell all three in this. This isn't as bad as I thought. I am not one of those cinnamon people. I don't like my house smelling like cinnamon during the fall. And since I have real trees anyway, I'm not really on that pine, you know, scent that much either. But this is a nice blend. I think I can deal with this one. So I will be back with some more scents, but I wanted to get these out for you right quick. So there you have it, the new releases. So I will have some more scents coming. We're gonna sniff together. I haven't smelled anything yet, so I'm waiting to do it with you. So thanks for watching as always. Please remember to thumbs up, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.